Hey everyone, this is Car Show Radar. I'm Randall Cass, and you are with me today in Whitesboro, Texas. We're at the 50th Annual Peanut Festival, and this place is packed full of people, hot rods, motorcycles, military equipment, you name it, it's here today. There's a festival over this way, but more importantly, there's a car show back this way. So let's go down there and see what we can find. Man, I gotta tell you, at the Car Show Radar, we love a well-done 50 Merc lead sled, and a lot of it has to do with the fact that it looks like the Car Show Radar website logo. I mean, look at that. Isn't that amazing? Both of them look great, so there it is. All right, we've got a really interesting story here today on this 1938 Chevrolet Master Deluxe Coupe. This is Randy George, he's a really good friend of mine. We do a lot of car stuff together. In fact, you and I just rebuilt the motor on my 65 Comet. We did. Exactly, and now you know Gary here through a third party, because you guys both are from Grand Island, Nebraska. Correct. Which is a long way from here. So how do you know Gary, and Gary, this is your car, right? Yes. Okay, I'm getting confused, but go ahead. This vehicle, and I'm sure uh, Gary will tell you, actually Ron White was the owner of it previously, mm -hmm. and Ron White's sister, Liz, and I went to high school together in Great Island, Nebraska. Okay. Northwest uh, High School, and that's where uh, Gary graduated with Ron. I went to school with Ron. Oh, you went, okay, all right, great. So you had the car originally. Yes, I and bought then, it in 75. Okay, and then you sold it to Ron. Yes, in 76. And then he did all of this to the car, right? And then you were able to buy it back from him under sort of bad circumstances, unfortunately. Yes, I had told him I wanted it back uh, if he ever decided to get rid of it, which he didn't have planned to get rid of it. And had a third bout of cancer and uh, had to get rid of it. I've seen the post on uh, you know, Facebook and, uh, that Ron had uh, posted, and Liz was attached to it, and that's kind of how it all came together. Wow. And, uh, so uh, he said, going to have a small town in Texas at a peanut festival, and I was like, oh, we're going to that show, right? Yeah, we're going, yeah. Right. Perfect. What a great story. The hot rod stays in the family, and it's here today for us all to see. Man, I had to show you this gorgeous 64 C10 Chevrolet pickup. It looks brand new. And I happen to know that this is a one family owner truck. The dad bought this brand new in Louisville, Texas, handed it down to his daughter, and the son-in-law is the happy driver of this thing today. This is nice. This is a 1960 Ford Thunderbird. It's very iconic. This car is in original condition, which means this is ripe for hot rodding. Well, that's it today for us here in Whitesboro at the 50th Annual Peanut Festival. It's been a great day, seen a lot of cool cars, met some very interesting people. But it's time for us to get down the road to the next car show. So, see us next time on Car Show Radar or go to the website, carshowradar.com. Give me your email address and I'll send you car show listings once a week. Thanks so much.